Have you ever heard about King Robert Bruce and the spider? If not, then buckle up because we are about to dive deep into a tale of perseverance and hope. Once there was a king in Scotland named Robert Bruce. A brave and wise ruler, he presided over his land with pride and honor. But as fate would have it, the English king marched his army into Scotland, forcing Robert Bruce into exile. Undeterred, Bruce gathered a small band of warriors, ready to defend their homeland against the English onslaught. Despite their bravery, the Scottish warriors were met with defeat, not once, not twice, but six times. Each battle left them weaker, their spirits lower, and their hopes dimmer. Eventually, the army scattered, leaving King Bruce alone and on the run. Forced to seek refuge in the woods and mountains, Bruce found himself in a place he never imagined, a king without a kingdom. As he hid in a cave one rainy day, he pondered his plight, his dreams of victory fading with each passing moment. And there he was, a king without a kingdom, hiding in a cave as the rain poured outside. As King Bruce lay on the cold ground of the cave, his eyes fell upon a tiny creature, a spider, busy spinning her web. This humble creature, insignificant in size but mighty in spirit, became the center of the king's attention. The spider was diligently at work, attempting to weave a web across the span of the cave. The task seemed daunting, the distance too great and the thread too thin. Yet the spider persisted, not once, not twice, but six times she tried, only to see her efforts fall short each time. The thread would not reach, the web would not hold, and the spider would tumble down, only to climb back up and try again. King Bruce watched, captivated by the spider's tenacity. He saw the creature fall, rise, and try again. He saw the determination in her actions, the unwavering resolve to achieve her goal. He saw in her a reflection of his own struggles, his own defeats, and his own desire to succeed. But then, on the seventh attempt, something remarkable happened. The spider, instead of repeating the same process, changed her approach. She began to spin her thread from the other side of the cave. And this time she succeeded. Her web was spun, her goal achieved, her perseverance rewarded. Watching this display of resilience and ingenuity, King Bruce felt a surge of inspiration. He saw in the spider's actions a lesson for his own situation. Just like the spider, he had experienced defeat, he had felt the sting of failure, but just like the spider, he too could rise, adapt and try again. The spider's relentless spirit, her refusal to accept defeat, sparked a new hope in King Bruce. He realized that failure was not a final destination, but a stepping stone towards success. He understood that persistence, adaptability and courage were the keys to overcoming any obstacle. This small creature, with its relentless spirit, sparked a new hope in the heart of the king. As he emerged from the cave, he was not the same defeated man who had sought refuge there. He was a king, inspired and ready to fight for his kingdom once more. With renewed energy and determination, King Bruce emerged from the cave when the rain ceased, declaring, I shall try the seventh time. His spirit, buoyed by the relentless spider, was a beacon rallying his scattered soldiers. He ordered them to scour the land for more brave hearts willing to fight for Scotland's freedom. With each passing day, as the ranks swelled with men, the air crackled with anticipation. Strategy meetings were held, weapons were polished and battle cries practiced. The day of the seventh battle dawned. The Scottish army, under the command of King Bruce, faced the English forces. The battle was fierce, with both sides fighting valiantly. But this time, something was different. The Scots fought with a tenacity and vigor that could only come from a place of deep conviction and hope. And so, King Bruce of Scotland won the battle reclaiming his kingdom. His bravery and perseverance, inspired by a small spider, had led him to victory. The story of King Robert Bruce and the spider is not just a tale of a king reclaiming his kingdom. It's a universal lesson of perseverance, resilience and the indomitable spirit of hope. The spider, a tiny creature in the grand scheme of things, embodies the virtue of tenacity. Despite failing six times, it didn't lose hope. Instead, it adapted and on the seventh try, it succeeded. This small creature's determination inspired a king to rise from the ashes of defeat. King Bruce's story is a testament that failure is not the end, but rather a stepping stone to success. Repeated failures didn't stop him from trying again, and when he did, he triumphed. It's a reminder to all of us that no matter how many times we fall, we must pick ourselves up and keep going. Remember, success might be just one attempt away, so never stop trying.